Hey, what's up, y'all? Uh, yes, and um, today I'm going to uh, uh, to do a video on um, my mom ranking. Uh, um, yeah, on on ranking uh, Georgia's um, opponents in the uh, uh, the regular season. So, yes, I know that uh, that. Um, that um that a lot of people say that our schedule uh is is um is weak and i mean uh and i mean uh it it probably is and uh and uh you're gonna see why uh um but anyway but of course we can't help our schedule we can only play the teams uh that we play uh I guess uh b because eight of the teams uh that we play this year uh well uh we play them um every year and we can't help it uh if they're all down you know besides like Tennessee but uh and uh, yeah and 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 in our west schedulers who do play Auburn every year and and I know that they're down right now and then the other team that, that we draw from the West this year, of course, is um, Ole Miss. And I know that it's not like, you know, we're getting, uh, we're playing um, Alabama or LSU uh, out of the West. So, or LSU or, you know, Texas A&M, uh, you know, um, if they can, if they can uh, get their act together. Uh, but we, but we got Ole Miss, so, but, uh, but anyway, so, I um, mean, yeah, let's, 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 uh, I guess the only way that we could have, uh, made our schedule tougher was, uh, by, um, keeping Oklahoma on the schedule, but, uh, anyway, so I guess we'll start with some of these, uh, these, uh, these, uh, nobodies, right, these, uh, cupcakes, uh, we got, um, uh, at at number twelve, we have um, U T Martin, and they are an um, an FCS team. That's why they're at the uh, back of the list. And then at number eleven, uh, we have um, Ball State. Yes, a, a group of five team uh, from the uh, uh, the MAC, and um, usually they're not they're, they're not very good. They're pretty mediocre. Uh, my mom. Most of the time, so there's Ball State, and then at number ten, um, uh, we're we're gonna have um, my mom, U U U UAB. You know, yes, they're a, a group of five team from um Conference USA, but I mean they are you 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 know good for for a group of five team. Yes, they're a. Uh, They've been a uh, a uh, mom, a uh, uh, a a uh, really good uh, group of five team, uh, mom oh, over the last uh, several years, uh, but I mean still a uh, a a a group of five team. So, and of course, last time we played them, we beat them uh, really bad. So. And then anyway, so then uh, coming in at uh, number nine, I'm going to put um, the uh, uh, Vanderbilt uh, at at number nine. Yes, they are the uh, uh, the uh, uh, the least talented uh, team in the uh, whole um, uh, um, um, SEC, and they've been. Uh, Yes, and they've been um, really bad uh, recently. Although they were a little bit better uh, last year, but still, uh, but still. But anyway, and then and 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 then at number eight, well, I kind of struggled between you know Vandy and uh, and uh, and um, Georgia Tech about who to uh, who to. Um, uh, to put where I guess I decided that you know that Vandy was 
probably just a little bit worse. I mean, I do expect um, um, Tech to uh, make a bowl. Don't know if I can say the same about Vandy, but uh, and then and then a Brent Key is certainly an um, and an upgrade over um, over um, Jeff Collins. So uh, we'll see. Uh, so at number nine, I have uh, excuse me. Yeah, we're on number eight is where I had um, Georgia Tech, and then and then number seven, uh, we've got uh, um, Mizzou, and 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 now of course Mizzou usually ha hangs out around the uh, the um, six hundred mark. They've been you know um, mediocre ever since uh, Mama Mama Gary Pinkle. Uh, retired remember they were actually pretty good did win the east uh two years in a row like when they had first joined the sec but you know they've been hanging around you know 500 you know um since then so uh and they do have that uh that um five-star wide receiver in um in, in um luther burton but i mean burton but Really, uh, my mom, my mom, not much else. So, uh, so where are we? 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, uh, 6, right? I think we're on, we're on number 6. Um, and, and, um, and right here, um, this is where I'm gonna have, um, uh, my mom Auburn. Of course, they do have, um, have a lot of, um, quarterback issues, you know, that, uh, that, um, that, um, Robbie Ashford, uh, wasn't very good last year. I mean, he can run around, but, and then they, so then they did try to, um, uh, bring in, uh, Peyton Thorne, but, uh, from Michigan's, but, but I mean, he's just a, uh, a, a game manager from, um, Michigan State, so, Yeah, they need to uh, get some uh, uh, some better wide receivers. I do like their uh, running back, uh, um, Jaquez uh, Hunter. So, uh, of course, they did. They did bring in you know Hugh Freeze. It's gonna be be good for recruiting. They've been doing. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They've been doing really good in the uh, in the um, um, transfer portal. So. And then, uh, and then, uh, let's see, now moving on to, uh, number five, um, is where I'm going to have Florida. I mean, yeah, you know, Florida, um, um, is probably, yes, the, uh, uh the, uh, um, the, uh, the most talented, uh, I mean, of, of all, of all of our opponents, as far as like, you know, four and five stars and their recent recruiting, uh, but their, um, uh, but their, um, my mom coaching has not been very good. Of course, uh, my mom's son belt, Billy, uh, um, doesn't really know what he's doing, uh, with that talent, but still, you know, some talent. Um, still there, but, uh, uh, and, I mean, yeah, but they do have quarterback issues, you know, same thing with Auburn, you get, you know, bringing in, uh, my mom, my mom, Graham Mertz, I mean, he's, you know, decent, but, uh, he's really, uh, not really that good, so, uh, But um, yes, like I said, their their problem is 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 more that their problems have been more uh, coaching uh, than talent. So, and then how about we uh, head on down uh, to um, to um, number four? Uh, we um 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 this is where I'm going to have Kentucky. Uh, I do think that uh, that um, Kentucky, you know, you know, as a program, is in is in better shape than um, Florida or 
from Auburn. I mean, they, I mean, they, uh, I mean, I mean, I mean, every year since, uh, since 2016, that was the COVID year, they have, you know, won, uh, at least, um, seven games, uh, which again is a, uh, a longer streak than anyone else in the East, um, except for, uh, for, uh, for, um, Georgia. And then of course they do have the, uh, uh the, the occasional, you know, um, 10 win season and, uh, and, uh, and, uh, Mark Stoops is one of those, uh, coaches that, uh, that gets them, that gets the most out of his players, you know, you, you know, he's, he's, he's really good at, uh, doing more, uh, with less, uh, um, plus I like their, uh, quarterback situation, um, a lot better than, uh, than, um, than, than Florida or Auburn, uh, they're bringing in, uh, um, Devin Leary from um, NC State. So, and, and 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 I mean, they're also known for usually having a yeah, really good uh, run game. So, you know, good you know good line of scrimmage. You know, you know you know good defense. And like I said, getting the most out of their players. So, uh, but anyway, and now about um, uh. Forget it. Anyway, so how about we we move on to number three right here? I'm gonna have um, I'm gonna have um, South Carolina. Uh, I know that um, South Carolina seems to have a uh, a lot of momentum, you know, going into this year. Of course, last year, uh, my mom, my mom beating two top ten teams, Tennessee and Clemson. Um, in the, uh, the last two weeks, of course, they do bring back uh, my mom, uh, Spencer Rattler. So, um, uh, uh, but yeah, so I got them at um, Adam at number three. Of course, I already did a, uh, a preview video on on South Carolina, so you know that I had them going like um, eight and four. So. Uh, but anyway, so how about we move on uh, at number two? Uh, I'm gonna put um, um, Ole Miss. Of course, do have um, Mama Lane Kiffin, and, and and of course he's he's one of the best offensive coaches. He's one of the best um, offensive, you know, head coaches. He's one of the best. Um, Offensive minds in uh, college football today, of course they do bring back um, Jackson Dart um, at quarterback. So, uh, so I mean they're so I mean so I mean I think and and, and they do bring back uh, uh, that uh, um, Quinshawn uh, Judkins at him at running back. So, uh, so I think they're they're going to score a lot of points. Uh, the defense pr probably is not going to be very good, but. But they're going to score a lot of points. So, and then speaking, and then speaking of scoring a lot of points, um, at uh, at number one, uh, we do have um, Tennessee, of course, coming off of an eleven win season, and uh, and uh, yeah, just like with Lane Kiffin, you know, same thing with uh, with uh, with Josh Heupel. Yes, one of the better. Um, offensive minds uh, in the game, so um, so um, yeah, they do have um, Joe Milton. Even though they lost uh, Hinden Hooker, but it looks like uh, Milton, you know, you know, looks like he has fixed a lot of his uh, overthrowing issues. He looked um, really good uh, in the uh, uh, in the. Um, bowl game against Clemson. So, um, yeah, they're going to score a lot of points, too, but their defense, uh, yeah, their defense will probably be, um, a little bit better, so. 
But anyway, so um, yes, that's going to be it. It's going to be, so let's review again. We got number uh, 12 is UT Martin, number 11, uh, Ball State, number 10, UAB, number 9, uh, Vanderbilt, uh, number 8, uh, Georgia Tech, number 7, Missouri, number 6, uh, Auburn, number 5, Florida, um, number 4, Kentucky, number 3, South Carolina, number 2, Ole Miss, and number 1, Tennessee. Uh, uh, so there you go. But anyways, that's going to be it. So uh, thanks for watching. Uh, let me know in the, in, in the comments below, you know, which, you, you know, which, which teams you think I got wrong and, uh, and uh, where they should be. And uh, thanks for watching and I'll see y'all again next time.